following video for 2022 had been a request by Aaron Soto. Hi everyone. I'm Jonathan's Media Shack here once again. And for today's video, here is my review, slash, rant, on, Santa Inc., that came out in the year of 2021. So, anyways, enjoy. So basically what the plot for this show is, as the holiday season nears, Candy and her crew make plans for Christmas labor strike, and after a fateful run-in with Junior, Candy then considers the consequences of her actions, and that is it. That's basically what the plot for this series is all about. Now, what are my thoughts about this show? Oh my god, this is such an appalling abomination of a cartoon. I'll tell you the reasons why. 1. The animation for this series is very, very, disgusting. I mean, oh my god, what the fuck is this shit? I had seen some bad movies and TV shows with very bad animation, but holy shit, this one takes the cake for having the worst animation. It felt like someone didn't had that much creativity when making this shit, and used one of the tawdriest animation ever, and it looks very flashy as well. And somebody gave it a green lit for the animation for a series, and wouldn't you know, it looks like shit. Literally. That is how abysmal and nauseating the animation is, it's really that bad, and fugly. 2. The characters' designs also looks really ugly. These are one of the worst looking characters ever. They look like that it comes from a body magazine, and some of them are cardboard cutouts, and some are just plastic puppet animation. And between you and me, every single one of the characters are really ugly as hell. Hell, they are even just as bad as the Loud House, and Mr. Pickle's character designs, which both of these shows suck so bad. 3. The episodes are really mean-spirited, crude, violent, grotesque, and disturbing. Who the hell thought that it would be a good idea, putting all of those horrible things in a Christmas series? Huh. That is just terrible. 4. I find the plot for this series to be nothing but a pile of bullshit. Especially with the characters doing lots of dirty stuff in this series, it's really nasty, even for a Christmas series. 5. The way that the character moves in this series is very lustful, and awkward. 6. The music in this series is utter trash. 7. The characters in this series are really unfriendly, crude, evil-minded, cowardly, repulsive, hateful, grotesque, mean-spirited, inappropriate, body, vengeful, and very dirty. None of the characters were even pleasant, not even one, they were all too unlikable, and despicable people to be even pleasant characters. 8. The backgrounds for the series is terrible. I mean, who the hell made the backgrounds for it? because it looks really hideous, and gross. 9. There is too much unfriendliness going on in this series, and it never stops. Of course, because every single one of the characters are dirty, evil-minded, and mean-spirited characters. 10. The way that they show lots of inappropriate scenes are really disturbing. I mean, who wants to see disgusting images in a Christmas series? And who even thought that it was funny to begin with? That's just plain, wrong. 11. The theme song for this series is shit. 12. I find this series to be absolutely charmless, because there is no charm in this donkey vomit, whatso fucking ever. 13. Some people just do nauseating stuff, like throwing up, talking gross stuff, and lots more, and it's really nasty. 14. The jokes for this series is very anger-worthy. And finally, 15. I find this series to be the absolutely worst series from 2021. I would rather prefer Disney's House of Mouse, The Flintstones, Sabrina the Animated Series, Betty Boop, Rocky, and Bullwinkle, Sesame Street, The Mario Cartoons, The Muppet Show, Rugrats, Scooby-Doo, The Big Comfy Couch, Peanuts, 
The Proud Family, The Total Drama Series, The Simpsons, South Park. Happy Tree Friends, Tom and Jerry, Looney Tunes, The Fairly Odd Parents, Camp Laszlo, The Brady Bunch, Gilligan's Island, That Girl, Cheers, The Carol Burnett Show, and The Patridge Family a hell of a lot better than this wretched piece of shit series. This is a total disgrace to the Christmas series, and a total disgrace for a cartoon. And, so, for my final rating for Santa Inc., I'm going to give it, a 1 out of 7. What a horrible, horrible, horrible Christmas series. So, anyways, that's all for today's video. See you guys later.